Hello, this is a brief demonstration of Flex Sim version 7. This is a, a model for a car wash. And the cars enter through one of the two sources here. Uh, cars and trucks take roughly the same amount of time to process. SUVs and vans tend to take about the same amount of time. So the two different types uh, sort in from these locations. They come into a decision queue where they take a look at the queues for the car wash and decide whether or not it's worth coming. The logic is built so that when there are two cars in each of these queues here and two cars in each queue here, that the customer will depart because of the length of the line. Um, these three stations here are the vacuum and fueling stations at the car wash. Um, each lane is uh, equipped with a Sitco pump and vacuum uh, stations for the interior cleaning. With the current setup, even customers purchasing packages that do not come with fuel or vacuuming must wait through these same queues. Uh, we'll see in the alternative model here shortly uh, an idea to alleviate that issue. There's six employees total that are responsible for the vacuuming. And then the employees go and take the uh, cars and move them over into the queue for the car wash. Up to five total cars can be in the queue for the wash at any time before it starts to back up this area over here. Three cars at any given time can be processing through the car wash. A single employee monitors the car wash and sets the uh, positioning for the cars as they're coming in so that they're not straddling each other as they go down the conveyor belt. Uh, when the cars come out, they go into the uh, wash end queue where they're then distributed to one of the six drying stations at the car wash. The drying stations are not physical locations, it's more the amount of space available at the car wash for drying. You saw a car come down in this direction here. This is the detailing shop. The detailing shop has two employees and room for two cars uh, for a full service of uh, exterior, interior, or a combination of the two. The simulation counts the amount of packages done. This car will take a little while, but as we come up here, uh, you can see the number of packages that have been sold so far through the day. The count up here is in seconds. Um, and let's see. And so how do we get to which uh, car is going and getting which service? There's tables that are built within. This is the customer type. This table shows us which wash package the customer selects. These are the percentages of customers using those washes. And then this number here identifies which wash it is for use within the simulation. Similarly, there is another table for the fuel type that shows you whether customers are not getting fuel or getting fuel with their package. Briefly, let's take a look at the alternative model that was built for the car wash. The alternative model allows for express washes to occur without needing to go through those dry, uh, the uh, fuel and vacuum cues at the beginning. So the car wash expects that if they were to do this, about 75 cars per day would utilize the express wash uh, direct and uh, so that is what the simulation is built in uh, with that logic at 75. Yeah. I'll advance a little bit more into the day so that we can get a vibe for how it works. We estimate it'll take about 30 seconds at the express pay processor that's merely to gather credit card information from them. The yellow boxes indicate a processor that is either broken down or is waiting for an employee to come and um, 
process the car that is waiting for them. Let's really ramp up the speed here so we can get to the uh, the end of the day. The car wash is open for nine and a half hours. The runtime is just a little beyond nine and a half hours to allow for the queues to empty out and the cars to uh, get dried at the end. As we come over here, we can see the statistics for the day. and how many of each one of the packages was sold. And now you can see it up close. So there you have it. It's a flex sim model of a car wash uh, and an alternative to their existing design. I hope you enjoyed, have fun, and uh, maybe learn something. I know I did. Thanks for watching.